Here's the Morgantown Community Board for April 22nd through April 28th, 2018, kicking it off with Mishi Art celebrating 1,800 followers. So to thank her followers, <laughs> they're going to be doing a giveaway. You simply need to follow and retweet to enter. Two winners will win a bust portrait. And if it hits 2,000 before the 29th, there'll be a drawing for a BlizzCon badge. <laughs> so make sure you get in there and get that. Next up, Katie Deathhope on Twitter is giving away a Murloc mug, which isn't sold in the store anymore, as well as a Treasure Goblin plush. Did we decide if it was sold in the store yet? Yes, it is. It's still there? Okay. So if you'd like a chance to win the mug or the Treasure Goblin, or maybe another random prize that she'll decide to mail out, just follow and retweet, and the giveaways will end on May 4th. All right. And now on Twitter, at Gustav Ferry, it's G-U-S-T-A-V underscore F-E-R-R-I, doing a giveaway for 100 followers. You just need to follow these simple rules, follow them on Twitter, retweet the tweet, and that's it. It's going to end on the 1st of May, and you'll get your chance to choose between a gesture or a not print. So go and check it out. Last for our contest, Technically PvP, a, a, another podcast about Warcraft PvP, is doing a giveaway to celebrate their 50th episode. Congrats to them for getting to 50. All you have to do is like and retweet the tweet as well as follow the hosts Winstead and Andalyn. It's Winstead84 and Andalyn1244. You can win one of four Met you can win one of four Mount Pet bundles. This is for North America only. The contest ends May 1st. All right. Now, we had Devouring Eye on our show a little while ago, and you might have noticed on Twitter recently that they have started tweeting about something called Zandalari Pepe. Oh! <laughs> so... We just want to remind you that they have a Patreon that you can sign up for. And if you sign up for May 1st, you can possibly be included in the next commission giveaway. Next up, Fabelina has battleground badges that she is going to be doing this year. So check out her website, fabelinaart.com slash badges for all the information on how you can order yours. And Zulterathart is going to be doing BlizzCon 2018 badges. They're going to open up on Tuesday, May 1st. So you can go to their Badgers page or make sure you just look out on their Twitter for more. That is at Zulterathart. And we had some birthdays this last week. So happy birthday to Tumblebuck. Yes. Hope Flint gave you lots of licks. <laughs> and to another really awesome friend, and that is at PandaRuhu on Twitter. Yes, can't wait to see you at BlizzCon. Happy birthday. Our favorite bear. <laughs> and then on to special events. Remember that Con Before the Storm is happening. They've launched a Kickstarter that you can go and back. Which but that's how awesome this party this, is. This is an awesome party, and I'm sure that they will be adding some awesome stretch goals with goodies from community artists. So keep an eye on that and look forward to Con Before the Storm the day before BlizzCon. See you on November 1st. Yeah. <laughs> and Dravi is wanting to let everyone know that the Running of the Trolls, the in-game Warcraft charity event that benefits the Trevor Project, is going to be returning on June 9th. Remember to follow the hashtag TrollRun2K18, and you can see what is going on as we lead up to that event. So it's a good event to go and support. So make sure you come out for it. And Nuru Druid on Twitter is teamed up with Non-Toxic Gaming to raise money for St. Jude's Play Live event. So from now until May 31st, they will be streaming their weekend raids and the games I play during the, the week. Uh, so And any donations during that time will go to the charity. There you go. Hashtag play better, be better. And that wraps it up for the community board for this week. Hope that all of you have an outstanding week. 